This was a very difficult year and when you take all of the various things in consideration uh, with his health situation and so forth and it's just a hard job to be the head coach at Ohio State and, and I haven't had a chance to tell him what a great job he did. Uh, he, he took it to the next level. Uh, so proud of what he did, especially in those games uh, against the Wolverines. You know, there comes that point in time that sometimes you have to have the courage to step away. And I, I think, uh, you know, Urban obviously had the courage to step away and do what was best for he and his family. Well, you know, Ryan obviously did a good job uh, early in the season, and uh, he wouldn't be on the staff. Uh, Urban wouldn't have him there if he weren't a good coach. And he's got good background. He comes from the 1AA ranks. Uh, you know, like YSU here, he's from New Hampshire, and so he's had to work up the hard way, and I'm sure he'll do a great job. Well, you know, Urban's really busy, and I'm really busy, but when we need to get a hold of one another, we know we're a phone call away, and, and uh, you know, we have a little bit of a common bond in the fact that uh, we both sat in the same seat. You know, it's a seat that uh, we were both very honored to sit in, that people like Paul Brown and Woody Hayes and Earl Bruce and John Cooper sat in, and, and uh, you know, that puts you in a select family of its own, and, uh, and he knows I wish him uh, well tremendously and, and uh, he knows I'll catch up with him but he's been busy and I've been busy and uh, maybe we'll have a chance to relax one day. You know I've been at this for so long and, and been around athletics my entire life and, and really nothing surprises me. You never know what's going on uh, within a situation and, and but you do know the difficulty of every coaching situation so uh, you know there comes that point in time that sometimes you have to have the courage to step away and I, I think uh, you know Urban obviously had the courage to step away and do what was best for he and his family. Oh, I, I'm happy with where I am certainly I'm, I wouldn't trade my years of coaching for anything in the world uh, but I wouldn't trade what I'm doing for anything in the world so I've been blessed.